Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel Pisces Soul Tribe, what's going on you guys? Um, Hopefully this message finds you in good favor And that you are doing well on your journey If you feel you aren't, of course my intention is to grab a word from the divine To help you to continue to move forward on your journey Pisces Soul Tribe, want to get into a general read for you And of course anything you need from me can be found down below in the description box Okay, so you guys, I'm going to um, pull some um, cards from what's to see Just to grab the information surrounding you and then we'll see what's going on as far as the, the tarot is concerned. Hopefully you guys have been doing well. I want to thank you guys so much for the likes, the shares, the comments, for subscribing, um, personal reads. Like, it's been a time, man. It's been a real time. Um, Pisces, currently you're in the space where you're hustling, where, where you're on the move. I feel like you're in the space where you are truly focused. Um, I feel like your main focus is what you are doing as far as grounding yourself. Um, tangibility pinnacles um, I feel like your focus is on clear um, mental health and mental healing yeah I feel like a lot of people are watching too let's see what's going on what message is spirit okay so crying over you um, romantic love affair um, sex fix secret lover um, crying over you sad hurt upset what else So threatening, intimidating, threatened, bothered. Okay. And then last one, spirit. I'm not going to play with that. <laughs> uh, no. <laughs> nope. Nope. Not playing with that one. What else? Okay. Um, giving money. Giving money. Romantic love affair. Okay. Um, wants you back. Okay. I feel like there's somebody here. Of course, I feel like that you were once involved with um, that is now wanting you back. I feel like someone at this present time is recognizing your worth. Um, I feel like you are quite a catch is also what I'm hearing. And like, I feel like this is a person who's um, stuck in some six of cups energy. Um, thinking about you, wondering what's going on with you, um, um, looking you up, seeing about you. I feel like this is also somebody who's possibly crying over you, sad, hurt, um, in some form of despair. I feel like you dodged a bullet. This car was flipped over. I feel like you dodged a bullet and you're in a space where you're blocking negativity. I feel like you're, you are escaping crazy people and you, um, you're protected from haters. What else? What is this crying over you? So groupy. Um, this seems to be some type of friends is what I'm feeling. Um, people watching over you. Um, I feel like these are also people who um who are sad and who are uh, um who are hurt by you. I feel like um these are people who who were once in your energy who were taking advantage of your energy. And like I feel like with like, without the lack of your energy, these are people who are really truly finally finally realizing what you really brought to the table as well. What's threatening spirit? So Queen Queen Rising, um, stepping into your power, praise coming up, spotlight. I feel like there are people who are intimidated by this. You better speak. Y'all better speak, birds. Okay. Um. There's somebody who's intimidated by this. I feel like there has been conflict. I feel like there has been nagging. Because that's a lot of birds and it's a lot of noise. I feel like a lot of people have been nagging in your energy. I feel like a lot of people have been gossiping as well as talking about you. And if they're all talking about you now, um, they're talking about how you are on the up and up. I feel like something very unique is also working out for you and in your favor. Um, Spirit, what is giving money? So ignoring, um, you, uh, you're holding back right now from what I'm hearing. You're being smart about where you give is also what I'm feeling. Yeah. You're being smart about what you're giving, um, at this present time. Okay. Let's see what the Tarot has to say about this. Let's go. Mm, my goodness. 
Spirit, what is this romantic love affair and wants you back? Okay, that's too much. Take it anyway. Okay. Okay, give me a second, y'all. This is a lot. So, um, Nine of Swords, the Hierophant, the Death, Six of Wands, Knight of Cups, Eight of Cups. This is someone here in your energy who is um, stuck, um, disillusioned, um, possibly having nightmares, up late, thinking about, constantly on their mind um, about a relationship that has come to an end. But it's been very successful for you, Pisces. Um, you're in this um, Six of Wands, or they're viewing you in this Six of Wands um, energy where you are really at the forefront and all eyes um, are on you. There's something about you that's very attractive um, at this moment that is wanting people to um, offer you things. But um, with the Eight of Pentacles after the Knight of Cups, um, someone's walking away with, with empty cups. Their cups are not being filled up. I feel like somebody has to finally leave all their cups behind, especially all the ones that they, they invested um, with you. There's a sense of something not really working out. I feel like this is somebody who's very hurt. I feel like this is somebody who's also upset, to be perfectly honest with you. Last one. What is this? Eight of Cups spirit? Temperance. You've changed. The dynamic has changed. How you, how you give and what you give your emotions to has changed there's something i'm very fond about as i said about you working on yourself at this present time the number nine is very significant while you're most times pisces and nine of cups or nine of pentacles energy a lot of people that um were in your energy or involved with you are in this um nine of swords energy um seeming seemingly um like trapped in spaces where where they're thinking about thinking about you possibly thinking about things that they've done um reliving past experiences traumas having dreams about um possibly you or possibly what could happen to them because of the things that they've done towards you um un, you know unjustly is what i'm feeling spirit what is this crying over you and grouping okay so um, the High Priestess, the Page of Pentacles, the Four, as well as the Magician. These are people who are really truly seeing you, who are really who are really watching you under the <laughs> under under the moonlight, in the dark. Especially with the high priestess. Not not really speaking up to you either. I feel like these are people who um, are watching you manifest. Who are watching you move into new spaces. Who are watching you try, try, triumph over evil. I know that's like so superhero, villain. Um, there are people who are seeing you being very successful on your journey. And also being successful in what it is you are manifesting new. What you are creating now. What you're bringing into the world now. After um, after an ending. After starting over. Yeah, three of swords at the bottom of the deck. I feel like these are people in your energy who possibly know. Who know or knew about some things um, involving a previous relationship that you were in. And they're seeing you take something. What they would consider small take it and run with it something's really working out in your favor is also what i'm hearing what else i feel like these are people who are hating too people who are possibly jealous in your energy as well six of pentacles something is um equally balanced for you something finally is in in in, in balance um, where it's continually and repeatedly um, given to you as you give something is being given to you um, as well but definitely something is being balanced something is being made fair is also what I'm hearing what else
Damon. I feel like um, what people think they know, they don't know. Yeah. What else? Yeah, Five of Swords. Hold on, you guys. Yeah, okay. So Five of Swords and um, the Strength. There's something very strong um, here about um, your connectivity to, to the divine. Um, high priestess um, as well there's something about you knowing um, that you were supposed to that you were supposed to start over I feel like you were given a download that uh, of some new journey that you were that you were needed to take some manifestation that you were needed to take I feel like these are people also who um, who are in your energy who who are viewing that I don't think anybody's crying over you or anything like that. I feel like people are really, really in a space where they're seeing you be successful. But with this groupie, they're secretly loving what you're doing. They see something working out in your favor. No matter what, with the, especially with the moon to the five of swords to the strength. <laughs> your focus is clear. Threatening queen rising. What is this spirit? The tower. The star. Four pentacles. <laughs> what else? <laughs> yeah, just like I said. Okay. So the lovers, the nine of cups. So the tower, the star, four of pentacles, the lovers, as well as the nine of cups. Some wish fulfillment, some rising, some um, place where, you, where you're being put out in the forefront is going to be very unexpected. This is going to come to a surprise um, as a lot of people. I feel like you were also put in a space where you put all offers of love, not choosing those loves, but choosing yourself with the four of pentacles to the lovers to the nine of cups. I feel like you chose to choose yourself. And with that, you, you received offers. You began to receive new inspirations. You began to receive new desires, new downloads, um, new inspirations, new ideas that you wanted to implement. I feel like with you focusing on yourself, you opened up a floodgate of things that were being uh, put on hold for you. I feel like you were holding back a lot of things to make you, you were holding back your happiness. King of Swords. What else? Eight of Wands. Someone wants to talk to you. Who is this? Someone who is now having some fond sense of love for you, especially with the Queen of um, Queen of Cups. So the King of Swords to the Eight of Wands to the Queen Queen of Cups. Somebody wants to talk to you. Um, Queen of Swords. At the bottom of the deck now. I feel like this is somebody you're ignoring. <laughs> somebody is possibly needing your help. Eight of, eight, Queen of Cups. Justice. With the sun. Somebody needs your help. Somebody is needing something from you is also what I'm hearing. <laughs> That's funny. Spirit, what is this giving giving money and ignoring? Does this correlate? <laughs> Knight of Swords. Uh, the Wheel of Fortune. What else? Six of Cups. What else? Knight of Pentacles. This is a lot of forward movement. This is a lot of energy. Okay, so let's see. 
something is quickly um, approaching you. I feel like something is definitely going to be um, unex- unexpected. But this is also something that's very familiar um, here to you. Something very familiar to you, something that you've done before, something that you um, are familiar with. The star is very significant here um, as well. I feel like these are dreams that you possibly um, had as a child. And like I feel like something is coming back to you. Eight of Pentacles. Some memory is coming back to, um, to you for you to remember it. Something you possibly forgot about. Yeah, especially with the um the hangman. So the hangman, the three of wands, as well as the two of pentacles. This is something that you've forgotten about from time to time. But like, I feel like this is finally coming back to your 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 remembrance. The way somebody really truly didn't give something to you, and like, I feel like that's why you're ignoring somebody as well at this at this at this present time. There was once upon a time where you needed help with this six of cups to this knight of pentacles to this hangman. Somebody stood on their ass with the three of wands to the two of um, coins to the two of pentacles. I feel like some sort of energy is also um, reverting back on someone. What somebody did to you, they're now experiencing. And like, I don't feel like this is any this is anything that you've done on purpose. I feel like you're in no contact with somebody, and that's no contact. Period. Like you, if somebody needs anything or whatever, that doesn't have anything to do with you. I feel like you were in a space where you were in no contact before somebody reached out to you, possibly um, wanting from wanting some form of help if if they haven't done it already. But like I feel like this is somebody who um, adversely did not help you when you needed help, and like I feel like there was just a space where somebody um, wasn't honest about that um, as well. So yeah, um, I will be ignoring it as well. <laughs> um, what else? Any other important messages, spirit? Okay. So Ace of Cups. Seven of Pentacles, um, the Chariot. Some some overflowing emotion, some form of love. Um, possibly some new relationship is growing. Um, is growing very um quickly. Is is what I'm I'm feeling, or some relationship that you may be um involved with. I feel like it grew. It it was a point of time where it was growing slowly. Something took some time, but something's about to something's about to happen. Something's about to change. With the three of um, pentacles. What else? To the four of cups. Why the four of cups? The number three, four is very significant. 34. Page of wands. Some collaboration isn't really working out. Okay, hold on. There's always um I know I live by the the hospital um but every time I do a reading for you guys lately there's always a siren. Um I'm hearing ring the alarm. Um I feel like something really is trying to get your attention. But like I feel like while something is getting you trying to get your attention, something is also trying to distract you as well. Even if it's only for a moment, that moment could cause uh, a lifetime so um be be, be vigilant. Pay very close attention is what I'm feeling. Okay. So Ace of Cups, Seven of Pentacles, the Chariot to the Three of Pentacles to the Four of Cups to the Page of Wands. Some collaboration isn't quite grabbing your attention. Um, there's something really here that isn't like really, really connecting. I feel like your focus um, wants to be elsewhere. Something that you could possibly cre um, create. I feel like you're looking for some form of message, some form of download, some form of uh, some form of something to let you know that something makes sense. Listening to your intuition as well. Page of um, Wands. Okay, that's too much. And then I actually just slid off. Page of Wands. Okay, so two. Okay. So the Ace of Swords as well as the Empress. I feel like there's a space where you're, you're needing to focus on being this Empress. 
getting some form of clarity about who you really are what really excites you what really what really gives you passion what really gives you drive i feel like you're very um nurturing very caring um as well and like i feel like you you leave the gate open you know i feel like you leave a pathway open for those who may possibly need it while there is some form of protection and some form of of guard there is something about securing what is important um to you behind you is also what i'm feeling but yeah, that was the reading, you guys. Um, hopefully this message resonated with you in some way, shape, form, or fashion. And you're <clears throat> okay. Um, and you're able to take something from it that you could use. Um, Pisces Soul Tribe, if there's anything that you need from me, you can find those details down below in the description box. And as always, Pisces Soul Tribe, remember to conquer this day. Bye, guys.